Hello everybody here from Krakow um, on the next uh, Sharp event. Um, I'm Mark Schiedel. I'm the sales manager from Brightsign for the Dach region and Eastern Europe parts. Um, happy to welcome you here. We are here to show our latest products. So we Brightsign is a manufacturer of digital signage media players. So we do this kind of uh, little boxes which are uh, known for their reliability, security, stability um, to fire up your digital signage presentations in a secure, reliable, um, stable way. So we have different kind of products. This is you have the right player for the right project for the right price, right? So starting with a small LS series media player where you have uh, a price sensitive projects uh, where you can f uh, fire up full HD or 4K um, digital signage screens up in the row over a HD player, which is our bread and butter player, which can do interactivity, um, touch displays, and so on, right up to the to the one um, really big players, which have four HDMI outputs. So we can uh, easily do with one player projects like the wall behind me, where we have uh, four 4K screens that we can fire up with one passive cooled uh, digital signage player. You can whether um, show uh, content for the screens individually, or you easily create like uh, one screen video wall with this player. So one player, four HDMI outs and um, four times 4K. With our players, there comes uh, our Brightsign operating system, which makes sure that um, all the players are run smoothly and secure and stable. Um, additional to that, you get a, a cloud control, so you can um, live um, see all the health study of the player, check if every player is okay, what content is he playing, what output do, does he show. Uh, and you can control the player, so in a case of a support case, um, you can go directly over the cloud to the player, restart it, reset it, read out the logs, and help the player to, to get running again. The players can not only play just static digital signage content, but also, um, for example, fire up a, a touch screen. So you can connect every H, uh, HID uh, capable touch screen to um, all of our media players, basically. And with the players, comes also a free software which is called Bright Also, where you can really easy create your layout, your playlist and your schedule for your projects, even touch or interactive projects, and then publish it via a little SD card to the player or via network or via internet. So there are different publishing methods to get to make sure that you get the content onto the player. It's all store and forward principle. So you create your presentation in, your, in our free software and then transfer it to the player and it's stored onto the player so that we can make sure we run all the time all the projects. We have uh, um, some more um, examples to show here because our players not only can play um, looping videos or being interactive with touch videos, but we can control the player with different kind of interactivity and user engagement, right? So we can easily, our big partner um, is Nextmosphere. So they, it's a, a company from Eindhoven in the Netherlands, and they do all kind of uh, this um, controllers which you can connect to the bright sun players and you can interact with the bright sun player with different activators and sensors right so for example you have a presentation and you you the, the user can just um choose with buttons for example um the presentation there are some some wheels where you can control the presentation or even they have a air button so you can control it via the air right so swipe um, via the air. Um, you can do that in, in multiple ways. Of course, you can create your presentation as you like. And we have many kind of different options, sensors to interact uh, with our players. So one, for example, is here. As you see here, we have a retail object. And the idea behind that is we have a little presence sensor. And if you step into the product, it will get highlighted. So the, the audio goes on or the light goes on. And it's just a little presence sensor, uh, which, which not only interacts with our player and changes the presentation, but we can also count um, the visitors. So we can do analytics um, to count the visitors. Um, 
same for us uh, here is uh, like interaction with the with the client so if he chooses to to learn more about the yop um, Parfum, we show here the right content. That works with a little RFID antennas and a little RFID tag on the product. There are multiple ways to do this kind of lift and learn situation. So if you can't have a shelf with antennas, there's another method like here, if I look on the drill, showing the right content here, it's just a little wireless sensor on the product which triggers our player. One more interaction that we show with our players here is also an interesting sensor from Nexmosphere and you see that in the in the middle here it's a little uh, lidar sensor um, and the idea is if somebody is just grabbing the orange you see the correspondent content will immediately show the same like if we touch in another basket and it works like with a lidar um, span that we span around here and define just uh, sections um, where you grab in and then we control the players for that. So for every digital signage installation, we have the right player for the right price. We have the software which is included. We have a remote control to, to control your player fleet and your project. And we have uh, strong partnerships like Nextmosphere where we can add value, make presentations interactive, make unique uh, uh, applications uh, for that. So if you are interested in that, reach out to us. As I said, my name is Mark Schiedel. You can reach us via our brightsign.bits website and we are happy to help you with your next digital signage project. Thank you. Mm -hmm.